everyone, it's Helen. I have recently been watching a lot of bookshelf tours and so I thought I would do a tour of my own red books and um, some that are up here I've got the rest of this month's TBR and next month's TBR up in my room and then the rest on my TBR cart downstairs so I will start with these ones. The Polar Bears Explorers Club by Alex Bell. Nevermore by Jessica Townsend, Featherhood by Charlie Gilmore, Arsenic for Tea by Robin Stevens, A Dell of a Life by David Jason, Anne of Green Gables by Ellen Montgomery, The Lion Game by Ruth Ware, The Vine Witch by Luan G. Smith, Day Justice by Nick Stone, Northanger Abbey by Jane Austen, Happily Ever After by Kira Cass, Heartstopper Volume 2 by Alice Osman, and Olive by Emma Gannon. And I will now take you downstairs and look through my TBR card. We have The Last Battle by C.S. Lewis, Nothing Ventured by Geoffrey Archer, Nine Months in Tibet by Rupert Wolf Murray, The Maggie Smith Biography by Michael Coveney, The Secrets of Sunshine by Phaedra Patrick, Mac the Life by Lee Mack, Why We Dream by Alice Robb, Overcoming by Vicky Phelan, and Liar by Leslie Pierce. The Conjurer by Luan G. Smith. Eight Pieces of Silver by Patrice Lawrence. One of Us is Lying by Karen M. McManus. Amelia Fang and the Unicorn Lords by Laura Ellen Anderson. Christmas at the Beach Hut by Veronica Henry. Pet by Awake Ameze. Betrayed in Cornwall by Janie Belitho. Queen Bee by Jane Fallon Leap Year by Helen Russell The Inheritance Games by Jennifer and Jennifer Lynn Barnes The Rest of Their Lives by Jean-Paul Didier Laurent Over My Dead Body Murder at Eurovision by Christoph Fischer 10% Harry Happier by Dan Harris and The Confessions of Catherine Howard by Susanna Dunn we have The Catch by T.M. Logan. We have Utterly Brilliant by Timmy Mallet. We have The Joy of Big Knickers by Kate Garraway. Messy Wonderful Us by Catherine Isaac. My Brilliant Friend by Elena Ferrant. The Camino by Shirley MacLaine. One Enchanted Evening by Anton Dubeck. Keeper of the Lost Cities by Shannon Messenger. Meg Jo, Beth and Amy by Ray Tercerio and Brie Indigo. Dodger by Terry Pratchett. The Christmas Invitation by Trisha Lashley. And Hidden in Plain Sight by Geoffrey Archer. We have Raw by Cecilia Rahern. The Pilgrimage by Paolo Coelho. The Zookeeper's Wife by Diane Ackerman. This Changes Everything by Helen McGinn. Gone Viking by Helen Russell. The Readers of Broken Wheel Recommend by Katerina Vivald. Why Mummy Doesn't Give A by Jill Sims. Sari by Sue Dharma Parler. The Good, the Bad and the Worst. The Hundred Craziest Moments from the Eurovision Song Contest by Jeff Tibbold. Forever Liesel by Shami Ankar. Tinsel by Sabeel Pounder. Our Women on the Ground, edited by Zara... Hanke, Morality for Beautiful Girls by Alexander McCall Smith, Rat Burger by David Williams, The Thirteen Story Treehouse by Andy Griffiths, Self Help for Your Nerves by Dr. Claire Weeks, Fire and Rain by Diane Chamberlain, The Boy Who Lived with the Dead by Kate Ellis, Conquering the Dragon by Kim Go, The Willows in Winter by William Harwood, Notes on a Nervous Planet by Matt Haig. A Few of the Girls by Maeve Binchy, 
You should see me in a crown by Leah Johnson. Cinderella is dead by Caelan Baron. Love and Longing by Jacqueline Wilson. A still untitled, not quite autobiography by Ron Moody. The soundtrack to my life by Dermot O'Leary. Love Letters of Great Men by various writers. Blue Shoes and Happiness by Alexander McCall Smith. The Talahari Typing School for Men by Alexander McCall Smith. The Full Cupboard of Life by Alexander McCall Smith. And The Glamourist by Luan G. Smith. Lock Every Door by Riley Sager. Hard Times by Geordie Taylor. One by One by Ruth Ware. A Girl Made of Her by Nydia Hetherington. A Whole New World by Liz Braswell. The Boy at the Back of the Class by Anjali Q. Rayouf. The Helpline by Catherine Collette. Somewhere Close to Happy by Leah Louise. Outer Order in a Calm by Gretchen Rubin. The Garden of Lost and Found by Harriet Evans. In the Heart of the Garden by Leah Fleming. The Trouble with Rose by Amita Murray. Marley and Me by John Grogan. The Authenticity Project by Claire Pooley. The 39 Story Treehouse by Andy Griffiths. Freshwater by Akweke Ameze. Fairy Tale of New York by Miranda Dickinson. The Great Brain Robbery by P.G. Bell. The Door That Led to Where by Sally Gardner. The Wolf in the Water by Josie Jaffrey. Blood Orange by Harriet Tice. And The Woman Who Upped and Left by Fiona Gibson. A Clock of Stars by Francesca Gibbons. Christmas Magic by Kathy Kelly. The Husband by Deirdre Purcell. Joe's Boys by Louisa M. Alcott. Blast from the Plast by Kathy Hopkins. A Hundred Summers by Beatrice Williams. Will You Remember Me by Amanda Prowse. Sense and Sensibility by Jane Austen. Shame on You by Amy Haydenrich. Snowdrops on Rosemary Lane by Ellen Berry. Silent Nights Christmas Mysteries edited by Martin Edwards. Summer at the Cornish Cafe by Philippa Ashley. Gracie Fershaw and the Mysterious Guest by Sunazim Brownwig. The Book Club by C.J. Cooper. Everything I Know About Love by Dolly Alderton. The Merrill Street Movie Club by Mia Mark. Little Men by Louisa M. Alcott. The Christmas Saurus and the Winter Witch by Tom Fletcher. Better Than Before by Gretchen Rubin. The Deathless Girls by Kieran Millwood Hargrave. The Family Love by Louise Jensen. Heartstopper Volume 3 by Alice Osman. This is Not a Love Story by Mary Hargreaves. While You Were Reading by Ali Berg and Michelle Callas. And I Have No Secrets by Penny Jolson. So that is all my unread books. It's not including my Kindle books and my audio books, but all of my physical ones. I hope you enjoyed looking through all of my books and I will see you next time. Bye.